forget, if you like this video, be sure to hit that like, drop an elbow on that subscribe button, and crush that notification bell. Woo! We've got t-shirts, socks, cups, stickers, and all kinds of other epic merch over at MaySpaceTV.com. We've also got the link in the description below. Woo! What is going on, Monster Jam fans? Today we're back at the flood map, and this time we're going to see which insane creation monster truck can escape the flood and make it to the top of the mountain. At the end of the video, we're going to have a high-speed jump and crash challenge where we need you guys to be the judges. So at the end of the video, go to the community post and cast your vote. Let's sit back, buckle up those seatbelts, here we go! Alright guys, up first we're going to go with the Stars and Stripes El Toro Loco and we're off! On this El Toro Loco, we're going with the supersized BKT tires in the front and the suspension dropped in the back. This ought to be an interesting run, here we go! We're making it around the first curve. We get a little sideways there. Whoa, check it out. The flood is on its way. We've got to get moving. This El Toro Loco build seems to be a little bit slow. Whoa, look at the water. We're coming up to the rock slide. This could be tough getting by the rocks with those supersized BKT tires in the front. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. We just climbed over them. Now we're going to come up to the spot where the road's missing. We're making it through while we get sideways. Oh, and into the mountain. We're rolling over. This is not good. And we're into the water. And El Toro Loco is eliminated. Whoa. Check out this replay. We got a little bit sideways right there. And then into the mountain. And then the big splash. That was still a very nice run for El Toro Loco. Coming up next, we've got Max D with those extra supersized BKT tires. We've got to be careful though because these trucks with these tires will roll over easy in the turns. We're approaching the first big turn with the mud over the road. This will be a nice test for those supersized BKT tires. Wow, that was perfect! Let's see if we can see where the floodwaters are at. Whoa, we almost go off the edge there trying to look at the water. We're gonna have to pick up the speed or we're not gonna make it. We're coming up to the next big turn. Here we go. Whoa, oh, here we roll over. Let's see if we can power out. Now we go off the edge. All right, we're back up. We can try to go back up the mountain. We're still rolling just a little bit into the water, and Max D is eliminated. Check it out, though. We're still floating. Wow, that's pretty awesome. What a run for Max D. Let's check out this replay. You can see we went into the turn with just a little bit too much speed for those extra supersized BKT tires. Whoa, look at the water. Alright guys, up next we've got Grave Digger and we're off. On this Grave Digger, we've got the extra wide supersized BKT tires all the way around. They're very stable. Hopefully we'll have a good run here. We're making it up to the first turn. Wow, we're making great time. Here comes the flood waters. Whoa, we get off the edge there just a little bit. We're on the move now. We're approaching the rocks on the road. Here's some in-truck camera footage. Here we go, let's see if we can make it through. Yes, we make it through. Whoa, we almost went off the edge, though. That was close. All right, guys, now we're coming up to the spot where some of the road's missing. We're looking good. Whoa, check out the water. All right, now we've got a pretty good run coming up here where we can build up some speed. 
Let's take a look behind us. Check out the water. It is on the move. Wow, we get a bicycle there and we lose the hood. That's all right. We don't need the hood anyways. Here comes the bridge. We get a little sideways there. So far, Grave Digger has made it the furthest. So that makes him our leader. Whoa, check out the water. We get a little sideways and now we're rolling over. Oh, and Grave Digger is eliminated. But with that run, he is our new leader. Let's check out this replay. We just got a little sideways and that's all it took to send the truck rolling over and then the water catches us. Coming up next, we've got Zombie Fire with those top speed racing tires. Wow, we get a fast start there. We're coming up to the first big turn. Whoa, we got a little sideways, but we're able to save it. Oh, we almost lose it again, but we're able to get another nice save. This zombie fire truck has all kinds of speed. We're coming up to the next turn. Whoa, now we're rolling over and we lose one of our racing tires. This could be bad. We've got to get backed up. Here comes the water. Let's see if we can go. Woo! We're on the move. We're still going and we've only got three racing tires. Wow, check out the water. We got to get past the rock slide. Yes, we make it through. It's amazing how much speed Zombie Fire still has left with just three tires. All right, guys, now we got to make it through the spot where the road's missing. And we have no trouble at all. If we keep this up, Zombie Fire may be able to take the lead from Grave Digger. Let's take a look behind us and see how the water's looking. It's on the move, but we're still making great time. All right, now we're coming up to the bridge. If you take a look at the back of the truck, you can see where the rear axle is dragging on the road. That could be a major problem. Hopefully it'll hang on just a little bit longer. We're getting close to the spot where Grave Digger got caught by the flood. It's coming up right here. Yes, and we take the lead with Zombie Fire. Now we're heading to the cave. Whoa, we almost got into the side there. The further we make it up the mountain, the more Zombie Fire builds his lead. Whoa, there was a hole in the road. And now we get close to going off the edge. What a save. Oh, we clipped one of the trees. This is not good. It blew out our last rear racing tire. Now we're really out of control. Oh, and we go off the edge and into the water. Whoa. Zombie Fire, though, is our new leader. What a run. All right, guys, coming up next, we've got Son of a Digger with those mega mud truck tires all the way around. We are on the move. Wow, these mega mud truck tires are handling really well. As long as we don't have no major mistakes, we should be able to take the lead from Zombie Fire. We're making great time. Here we go, we can hit that gas and get going. We're coming up to the rock slide, this should be easy. Yes. Now we're approaching the spot where the road's missing. And it is no trouble at all for son of a digger. We get a nice grip there, check out the water. We're coming up to the bridge. Whoa, oh, and we get into one of the tree stumps. 
Yes, we're able to save it and we're still going. All we lost was the hood and the front fenders. There is no other damage on the truck. Whoa, that was close. Check out the water. Here comes the cave. We're getting close to the spot where zombie fire got eliminated. There's the hole in the road. Right about here. Whoa! And son of a digger takes the lead. And since he's the last truck to compete, he is today's Blood Escape Champion. We have a huge crash right there at the end. We're going to try to power out and keep on going to see if we can make it to the top of the mountain. Whoa! We roll over again. Here comes the water. And son of a digger is officially eliminated. But that does not matter because he is today's champion. All right, guys, here we are at the High Speed Jump and Crash Challenge. Don't forget, we need you guys to be the judges here. So at the end of the video, go to the community post and cast your vote for which monster truck you think had the best jump and crash. Up first, we've got Kraken, and he's off. That was a big time crash by Kraken. Up next, we've got Monster Mutt Dalmatian and he's off. Up next, we've got Megalodon, and he's off! Well, that is all for today, guys. Thanks for watching. If you like this Flood Escape video and want us to make another one, crush that like button like a monster truck. All of these epic monster trucks are available at BeamMonsters.com. Hey guys, check this out. We got another awesome video right over there. All you gotta do is click on it. Woo!